what's up y'all i just came to y'all because i just did like three videos on this one thing and i'm like you know what i'm gonna do one more video and merge everything together because it's gonna be just too much going on long story short went now, i didn't go shopping today because that, that was not my intention but anyway i wound up picking up max ruby woo okay so um everybody always talks about this product a lot of people rave they say all skin tones can wear it blah 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 it's awesome it's matte yay so i tried it on the store and yeah, it, was, it was cute it was okay i'm like okay i like this i think it was just a mental thing because i have heard so many positive things about it but it was okay like no lag was okay i did feel like my lips were hella dry like uberly dry um after applying it but i'm like okay i'll be able to deal with it whatever so i wound up a few about an hour or so later i went to a few other stores then i wound up going to sephora and by that time my mac ruby wool that i had tried on had wore off and i didn't want to open my new thing of ruby wool so i'm like i'm just going to add another red lipstick that they have so i go in and then i find this bow this is a sephora brand and this is called always red i think the only thing i like about this is that they when you take off the little plastic the the name go with it but it's called always red yeah always red by sephora so yeah I fell in love with it y'all like I liked it more than I liked the MAC I like the fact that it comes in this little thing here this is a lip stain though it's not a lipstick so it is a lip stain so I like this better and it's twelve dollars and the ruby was fourteen fifty so two dollars fifty cent yeah whatever so I'm like you know what I'm so mad about the ruby rule blah 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 I'm gonna take it back so I'm like let me come here and ask everybody's opinion now I did this on camera but I'm not even gonna post it I'm just gonna tell you guys now one of my you see guys see my lips my top lip and my bottom lip one lip has ruby woo and one lip has the sephora brand can you tell the difference can anybody tell me the difference or does it look different i did go ahead and line my lips with this jordana liner it's in um plush plum just case you're wondering but can you tell the difference between the brands I don't think so but you guys let me know so long story short um i think i'm going to take this mac ruby woo back ruby woo, ruby woo back because i just feel like it's a little bit drier than the lip stain is and i just really like the way the um sephora one looks like i feel like they look a little like a tad bit different but i can definitely feel it if anything like i can feel the difference my my one of my lips is drier than the other one part of my lips is drier than the other so i think i'm gonna take the ruby woo back so i'm just coming to you guys to see first of all can you guys notice the difference okay and second of all can you recommend me something else to get from mac for 14 50 because i'm not gonna go above this i was gonna get an eyeshadow but i was like i can get a whole palette for one eyeshadow that's me being free one fly i know i know but if there's a product that you could get from mac that you could recommend for somebody please let me know because i'm gonna go take i'm definitely gonna take this back i've been like going contemplating but i'm gonna take it back black i'm gonna take it back there's no reason for me to have both of these yes i uh, do have clients and stuff they'll be having to get this so they can use another red but um i just at this point i'm i could be using i need different exposures to different products so i don't want to have two colors that's pr pretty much the same thing there's no point in my opinion um so please let me know recommend me another um mac product it could be a lipstick i kind of want to add shadow but i'm like oh, i could get a whole palette and hell i could get a whole lipstick palette we're ready for mac products but that's okay i digress i just want to get something else from them um Maybe I'll pick up a concealer or something. I really want to try their concealers. Somebody recommend me something from that, please. That's in this price range. That's all I really want to stop in and say really quickly. Y'all stay tuned. I got so many videos coming up. Um, I just got a press. I filmed a lot last week. I just have to edit. So I'll have another one coming up tonight. And stay tuned. Y'all need to be talking to me. Like, I got a few people who I'm talking to. So I appreciate, hey, all my new people that's been talking to me. But y'all need to talk to me, like, for real, like myself like seriously i gotta give a shout out to tan keisha um i cannot remember her whole name like nikki like all the people that's been writing me on my videos i really appreciate it because like when you have like this small amount of subscribers you really appreciative of the people you do get who do watch you and support you so mwah, mwah, i love y'all anyway somebody help me help me i'll talk to y'all soon oh don't look at my nail polish Bye. Oh yeah, P.S. Y'all had picked up from Sephora also two liners. These are called Nano Liners. One is in, um, whoa, one is in pure white and one is in blah blah blah. blah. Wow, Spirit. It's this purple and white color over here. It's the lipstick right here. The white and the purple. They're only five dollars a piece and they glide on really smoothly. So I like these. And also, did y'all guess which lip was which? By the way. Hmm. 
Hmm. Shoot. Top lip. Hell, which one? Yes. <laughs> Top lip is Ruby Woo, and the bottom one is the Sephora Amazing Red. So, yeah. I'll talk to y'all soon.